I think we all learned in school at some point not to use the word stuff, but I feel like that's the word that most describes a lot of what we fill some of our selection rooms and product catalogs with is just stuff. Things to just have there to offer that maybe it's that golden ticket that's going to help somebody grieve better or um, feel a little bit more warm and fuzzy while we're caring for them. But a lot of it is just that, it's just stuff. Um, so I think I, I like to go back to the um, phrase, keep it simple and do it best. You know, do what you do the best without doing all this other fluff. Yeah, that's what a lot of it is, is just fluff. So product offerings, you know, keep them simple. Don't have 12 different things that folks need to choose from on top of caskets and vaults and printed material. I always thought it was crazy that people would have, here are eight different register books. Really? Because that should be a something else that they have to choose when they're there. Like, here's a register book. It's included in the printed package. You know, keeping it simple so that folks don't have to go through that mental process too many times of making all these choices because they're exhausted and they're sad and they're just not in the mental state to do that. So keep it simple. So for two reasons you're doing that. You're keeping your selection simple. You're keeping your offering simple. One is so that the customer has that better customer experience. They're not burned out beyond all belief um, because you're offering them all these little trinket things, you know, too many things like, you know, having a candle um, to offer. But when you have like a candle and a bookmark and an ornament and a locket and a this and a that, it gets to be too much. And then on that flip side, they have a relationship break with you because they see the salesman -y side coming through, the saleswoman -y side coming through because you're trying to offer them too many items. So don't have stuff just to have stuff, I think is the, the end all statement of it. Keep it simple, really focus on having good offerings and being able to do them well. Because if you're spending your time, especially in small funeral homes where it's maybe just you or just you, your wife, or you, your husband, or maybe just one secretary, and you're running around trying to make this candle last minute, and trying to make the DVD cases, trying to make all this stuff, when you could be just spending a little more time on one or two things and doing them really well, um, you have less mistakes that way, you have better quality of product that way, so keep it simple. End of story.